guys today neil and elevae we're just having a friendly conversation about business outside the house friendships outside the house loyalty outside the house so it was as though that neil was trying to put elevae through or put her on on how things are going to be outside the house since a labor year season the level of season right a labor year did not get the full experience of the aftermath of big brother ninja house right so this is this will be a labor year's first experience according to her the first experience was more like a mistake in as much as new was trying to let her know that it wasn't a mistake it was more like a lesson that she learned because her page was taken down and she had to grow her page all over on instagram right then um new was trying to let her know that there are some certain things and there are some certain people you're not going to be close with not because you don't want to be their friends but because they don't support you positively and there are some business ideas you shouldn't just think of because be um because bio was trying to say that she would like to bring her fashion business to life and new was trying to let her know that why don't you just um collaborate with somebody instead of having a full business of your own because you won't be able to manage it then you see a lot of people coming in just to wear your clothes or probably pick a few pieces and they will never pay you you start experiencing what business is actually like you're not strong you're not capable of being in that space it's better you just put your money and collaborate with somebody that'll be doing all the dirty works and your only just to be making money that that will work perfectly which lucy affirmed to that and they were also telling her that i mean like coming out you're going to not be friends with some of your friends just because they don't support you positively or just because they, they are not with you 100 you know there are some people that you will not be able to tell some certain things maybe when you're broke you're telling reaching reaching them to let them know like your situation right and they will not believe you because they will be like are, are you of all people by you you know but you need somebody that will be there for you 100 but now Baye is not there yet because she did not fully experience her season last year because of left early then her page was taken down also she needed to build her page from scratch in as much as lucy was like ah that happened to me five times and i had to build my page five times so it's like it's not a mistake but it's a lesson you have to learn but it was like okay the reason why i have a better team now that are working with me so now that i'm not here now that i'm not there i'm here my management is strong 100 percent i mean like which is a lesson learned in it might it's not necessarily a mistake she might see like a mistake but being being like a lesson meaning she has moved on she has learned she learned something from there and she's making a better decision so that there was a lot of conversation that happened there they were just teaching by what to do and what not to do friends to keep up and whatnot so the next conversation we are going to be discussing on this video is doye doye's diary section was a lot of things doye spoke about the love how she loves by this is the first time she's coming up publicly to, to let us know that she loves by in as much as they are not talking i feel like yeah the distance that by is giving Donye is making her realize that see i was the only friend you had in this house and you cannot treat me like that i don't know if she has realized that she wasn't so much of a good friend to baye yet she hasn't noticed that in as much as baye wasn't a good friend 100 to Donye, but baye is not as bad as Donye. Yes, Doye will go all out for you. Doye is going to fight for you. Doye is going to do anything for you just because she's on your side. But Doye will still be the person to 
to say a lot of shit about you. Whereas Baye is not that kind of friend, right? Baye is the friend that will not carry the friendship on her head. She might not show it, but she acts it. That's she might not show it, she acts it. Acting it is when you don't go about like look at how she's she's so she's so she's so so disappointed in mercy because mercy will come to you laugh at you laugh with you rather play with you then go behind your back and say a lot of nasty things or maybe demeaning things about you might not be nasty but very demeaning things about you right now she's also that kind of friend she has been the friend to buy it. She has been that friend to CC in as much as maybe CC and doing they are doing the same thing. They are giving the they are playing the same card, right? But to buy it, buy it is not playing that card. Buy it, you will never hear Baye say anything demeaning about doing. She has never said anything. Instead, it's all love and light to doing it from Baye's side. But to but to doing she has said a lot of demeaning things so hearing from her today that she is she's happy with a baye she's happy that baye won she's happy and she loves baye she's rooting for baye and a lot of that guys i'm happy she said all of that because i mean like now we know that she's not actually so mad because she knows that there is really nothing that baye did what Baye did to her is not that is not that serious. I mean, it's more like I, I I want to give you your space. Give me my space, you know, because the insult is getting too much. And Baye heard a lot of things. If this is how Donye is acting, because she heard what Messi has been saying behind her back through Ike. So you can imagine what Elebaye would have done. Hearing everything that Donye said about her behind her back, you know. So in the house, Baye has been giving us this maturity and mature. I know how to let go of things, which is so not likely of a 22-year-old. You know, a 22-year-old want to battle and fight that, fight dirty with her best friend. Because that her best friend is not being a good friend, right? But... Bayou did not do that. Instead, Bayou just avoided doing all love and light, you know, giving her praise, giving her her accolades whenever her accolade is due, you know, praising her when necessary. And when it's time to talk down on her, she will just avoid the situation and just move out, you know, move out of, of that space. But Dwayne cannot do the same for for by it but anywho this video is about her diary section right according to her she mentioned that Ike had told her everything that mercy has been saying behind her back and mercy is not mercy so mercy is not that friend nice person she she portrays right in front of you mercy is dirty going behind your back to say nasty things that the other day they were having a conversation right a conversation about education when mercy came in mercy was like ah that this is not so important like the topic that they're talking about is not so important and she was like nah don't say that because education is very important not because we're not not because the conversation is not about cars luxury things clothes and all of that fashion you know you not say it's not important i mean just say that you're not educated enough to have this kind of conversation guys I was like, yo, Donye, your mouth is going to put you in trouble. But I mean, she was saying the truth. It's not about English or anything. But if you cannot have, if you cannot have a conversation or if you do not understand things about that conversation, why don't you just sit back and listen, you know, and learn? Nobody's, I know like Mercy is somebody that loves learning. But what she said, if she said what Donye said, if she did what Donye said, then I mean, that was nice. And, and Donye gave it to her. You know, the glass was, was really... He entered, you know. But then, I mean, like, maybe Mercy is Donye's karma. Would, would Donye look back and say, okay, 
Mercy is not a nice person. Mercy cannot stand up to me or say all of these things to my face. Mercy would rather just go to my back and say nasty things about me. Mercy is not a nice person. Would she also look back and be like, maybe I wasn't so nice too by, I don't know. Let me know in the comment section where you think. But the reason why all of this came up, right? She was like, eh, she prefers Vernita that Vernita will say whatever, whatever to your, fa to your face, insult you, say all sorts of things to your face. But mercy is just two-faced. She'll come to you, smile at you, and then she'll go behind your back and say nasty things and that's the reason why if big brother has said that she should pick three housemates to nominate as of monday without being specific guys you know big brother was specific two old housemates and one new housemate if big brother had just said nominate three housemates that she would have included mercy on that list you know, and I think how many, who and who did she pick? I know she picked Vernita and some other person, whether she, um, EK. I think her reason was because of what EK did or her reason. No, no, no. She picked Sheyi because her reason was because Sheyi said what EK did was right, that Sheyi wasn't remorseful about what happened i don't know i don't know and she picked the both of them because they were both there when the thing happened the thing that happened with ike and baye so i don't know i don't know I, i'm loving this doye maybe because she's having issues with the new alliance <laughs> with the new people they don't know doye with these new people you know she's having issues with them she also mentioned sissy she also spoke about sissy you know, in as much as she's having issues now with Mercy, she's seen the dirty side of Mercy. She's running away. Maybe that's the reason why she's saying all these nice things about Baye because she's trying to run down there. In as much as she's saying that, oh, that the way they are, she, she likes it that way. We even like it that way because they are both at peace in as much as Doe is not fully at peace. As long as Baye is fully at peace, we are good. She also spoke about Sissy, right? Her conversation about Sissy, what she told Big Biggie during the diary section about Sissy was more like, Sissy is being disrespectful. Sissy cannot handle what she dishes. And Sissy was expecting her to f run down to her as a toy now, that kind of thing, like worship her. And she's not going to do that. So if Sissy was going to disrespect her and do anything to her because she's the, she's the head of ours, that she wasn't going to just answer Sissy. She wasn't going to do as if she's seen. Like to her, Sissy is just invisible, you know. So because Sissy did not get that reaction that she was looking for, the reason why she was angry. And she's not going to run crying to Sissy. No, she's not going to do that. She's not a follower. She can be your friend without following you. And guys, that's just it. And she also mentioned that the reason why she has been staying clear from Eleba is because she doesn't want people to look like, it doesn't want it to look like, okay, she's not playing her game. Instead, she's all about Baye's game. She wants to be alone and play her game by herself, which is good, which is really good for, for doing and is also good for Baye. I mean, healthy space. I mean, they are both in a healthy space, especially by you, though. Anywho, guys, this is it for this video. If you haven't subscribed, like, share. What are you waiting for? Hit on the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell so you'll be the first to get notified whenever I post on this channel. And I will see you guys on my next one. Bye, guys.